There's an eerie mystique to Antarctica, a world cloaked in silence and unforgiving cold. It's no surprise this enigmatic landscape has been the haunting backdrop for numerous horror movies like The Thing and Alien vs. Predator. This frozen land conceals mysteries that accentuate its alien nature with only about 4,000 scientists and military personnel permitted to navigate its treacherous terrain during peak season Antarctica remains an untamed frontier here. Antarctica has long captivated the attention of scientists, even drawing the interest of tech magnate Elon Musk Musk known for his insatiable curiosity. Recently stumbled upon a significant discovery in the frigid expanse of the South Pole, and he's eager to unveil it to the world. What exactly has Musk found in Antarctica? and should global concern accompany this revelation beneath. Antarctica's icy surface lies an enigmatic realm, prompting it to be the ultimate frontier of our imagination. What secrets lie hidden beneath this frozen expanse, stirring our curiosity and fascination? Brace yourself to have your perceptions shattered. Everybody knows that Antarctica is quite beyond the common man's reach. But did you know that Elon Musk's Starlink has reached Antarctica in our day-to-day -day discussions of continents? Antarctica often remains a peripheral topic, yet for scientists and visionary explorers like Elon Musk, this frozen frontier becomes a canvas for curiosity. Musk, renowned for his relentless pursuit of the unknown, dispatches researchers to explore regions deemed inhospitable in a recent expedition. An initially overlooked object on the icy terrain revealed its true nature when it unexpectedly began to move as researchers delved into this mysterious object. It became evident that it held more secrets than anticipated. This incident mirrors a similar event from 1965 when a U.S. Navy surveillance aircraft encountered a saucer-shaped object hovering in the Antarctic sky. The images captured during that expedition sparked a UFO exploration craze, challenging established scientific views and prompting a deeper exploration. Of the region, the recent discovery in Antarctica not only opens new doors of possibility, but also sheds light on the delicate balance of life in this extreme meant. Scientists are now contemplating whether this seemingly uninhabited continent might conceal unexpected forms of life as the exploration of this ice-covered land continues. Mysteries unravel reshaping our understanding of Antarctica. Richard Byrd, a highly decorated U.S. naval officer, pioneer, aviator, and polar explorer, is renowned for his groundbreaking Antarctic expeditions, utilizing airplanes and cutting-edge resources. In October 1928, Byrd LED, his first Antarctic expedition, the largest and best equipped at the time, Little America. A well-supplied base was established on the Ross Ice Shelf, serving as a launch pad for flights over the icy continent. Byrd's exploration led to the discovery of the Rockefeller Mountains and a vast territory named Marie Birdland, honoring his wife. Byrd's legacy continued as he became the first to fly over the South Pole in 1929, completing the round trip from Little America in an astonishing 19 hours. This remarkable achievement earned him the promotion to Rear Admiral in 1933. Byrd returned to Antarctica to map and claim land around the pole. His resilience was evident when he spent five months alone at the Bowling Advent Base weather station. Despite facing challenges and having to be rescued due to severe frostbite and carbon monoxide poisoning, President Franklin de Roosevelt called upon Byrd once again again in 1939 and during World War I. Byrd served as the Chief of Naval Operations Staff post-war Byrd-led Operation High Jump in 1946, an ambitious Antarctic mission involving 4,200 men, 13 ships and aircraft carrier, and 25 airplanes. The mission aimed to map and photograph approximately 500 37 or 500 hours. December to March took an unexpected turn in February, changing its course dramatically. The mission initially focused on mapping and identifying sites for potential military bases, encountered something utterly unexpected and bewildering during Byrd's explorations, altering the course of the mission significantly one of the mission's goals was to identify and investigate sites for potential military bases similar to the well-known Little America. However, Admiral Byrd encountered something during his explorations that was so unexpected and bewildering that he initially couldn't believe it before delving into the actual events. 
It's crucial to note that the following account, while not part of his published official statements, is derived from Admiral Byrd's diaries. What he witnessed was not only terrifying, but also revealed a long hidden secret of the US government during various expeditions to Antarctica. Admiral Byrd had heard rumors of an entrance to the center of the Earth through the South Pole. Intrigued by this claim, Byrd took planes under the South Pole. As soon as he flew over the pole, he began seeing things that shouldn't be there. The icy expanse transformed into a lush green area, a stark contrast to the typical Antarctic landscape in his diary. Admiral Byrd wrote about encountering a shimmering rainbow city made of crystal. Suddenly, he found himself surrounded by disc-shaped flying objects, causing him to lose control of his aircraft for forced to land on the ground. He was escorted into a cavernous area where he encountered another being referred to as the Master. This supreme being discussed serious current affairs with Byrd, expressing deep concerns and disappointment over the use of nuclear weapons that had destroyed Hiroshima and Nagasaki. The Master conveyed hope that humanity would abandon violence and embrace peaceful coexistence. Admiral Byrd's extraordinary account documented in his diary holds immense significance for UFO researchers. The modern UFO ERA coincided with the aftermath of World War II and the detonation of the first atomic bombs. Following these events, people worldwide began reporting sightings of strange flying objects later termed UFOs. Notably, a significant number of UFO sightings have been reported in the vicinity of naval military bases and nuclear missile silos. Admiral Byrd's story aligns with the accounts of numerous Air Force officers stationed at U.S. missile silos, some of whom have admitted that their nuclear arms were disarmed by what they perceive to be extraterrestrial beings. If Byrd's narrative holds it, implies that we are not alone in the universe, and that aliens may already be present on Earth, actively monitoring us to prevent catastrophic nuclear events. The possibility arises that these beings could belong to a planet that faced destruction due to nuclear warfare. And they sought refuge on Earth, keeping a watchful eye on us to prevent a similar fate. When Admiral Byrd encountered these extraordinary beings in Antarctica, he initially made official statements about them, later retracting them upon his return home. Subsequently, he was compelled to remain silent, and all information he shared was classified. Consider the profound implications of Admiral Byrd's account. It challenges the conventional belief in the non-existence of aliens and, and exposes the falsehood of the supposed cosmic silence. The revelation suggests that extraterrestrial beings may be living among us, even beneath the surface of Antarctica. Admiral Byrd's credibility is noteworthy given his distinguished service and numerous discoveries in Antarctica. It raises questions about fairness in acknowledging and accepting certain expedition findings while dismissing others as if they never occurred. The U.S. government's desire to conceal the hidden secrets of Antarctica becomes evident. Yet Admiral Byrd, despite his initial silence, ultimately confessed everything he witnessed in his diary when his son uncovered and revealed the diary's contents. The concealed truths of Antarctica could no longer be silenced or ignored, as numerous discoveries continue to challenge our preconceptions about Antarctica. One significant revelation includes the recent moving object identified by Elon Musk's team. However, before delving into the this latest finding, let's explore other mysterious discoveries at the South Pole that hint at the possibility of life existing in Antarctica. The South Pole has become a hot spot for peculiar findings, capturing the attention of scientists eager to unravel new mysteries reports range from enigmatic items hidden beneath the ice to unexplained flashes in the sky, creating a symphony of intriguing phenomena. One such account comes from Linda Moulton, detailing the Spartan 1 exploration in 2003 during the Spartan 1 expedition. A team of explorers was dispatched to investigate reports of strange sightings in Antarctica. What they uncovered was truly astonishing. A colossal structure unlike anything encountered before, this massive octagonal manor emerged from the ice, boasting doors approximately 183 ft thick. The scientists captivated by the mysterious structure discovered that the doors could be effortlessly opened with a simple finger's push, defying the frigid temperatures. Beyond once inside, the team found something even stranger. 
the interior of the structure was surprisingly warm with temperatures ranging from 68 to 70 C2 degree fit. There was also a weird lime green light and the walls had mysterious symbols that looked like ancient writing. Antarctica holds a remarkable secret, an underground river as long as the Empire State Building. Unbelievable, right? This hidden river stretching 300 mm beneath Antarctica's ice sheets was uncovered by scientists using an ice-penetrating device attached to an aircraft. Initially, researchers thought it might be four separate rivers, but it turned out to be a single impressive waterway. Beneath the icy surface, the discovery raises concerns among climate enthusiasts. Because if the region experiences rising temperatures due to climate change, it could lead to a significant increase in sea levels worldwide. The potential consequences range from a 14T rise to an alarming 230T rise. If all of Antarctica's ice were to melt, posing catastrophic threats to humanity, these findings hinted at a time in history that was more advanced than ours, adding to the mysteries hidden in Antarctica.